Danger Man here for Behind the Bunker. This week's question is, what format do you prefer? Milsim, Speedball, or Rec Ball? And I'm with? Jimmy Gazoles. Where are you from, Jim? I'm from PA. Okay. What do you prefer? I prefer Milsim. And tell me why. Um, preferably Milsim, more relaxing guys, more family-oriented, and Speedball, honestly, a bunch of dicks. And now, what about, uh, so Rec Ball obviously fits into Milsim. Why Milsim over Rec Ball? Uh, rec Ball usually get... Like if you look behind us, there's probably a couple of just beginner players, and you can't play. You don't want to play as aggressive because you want the players to continue on playing. Right. And most of them usually get with people that are more advanced, like us two, that can actually handle getting shot and actually go out there and want to play hard and not afraid to get shot. Pretty much. Great answer. I love it. Thanks. Is what format do you prefer to play in? Scenario, Milsim, Rec Ball, or Speed Ball? And I am with. PJ Tafe. And where are you from, PJ? Uh, Middletown, Delaware. And I'm also with? Craig Wright. And where are you from, Craig? I'm from Salem, New Jersey. All right, so question to you first, PJ. Uh, uh, what do you prefer? Uh, definitely the military sim woods ball. And what, do you, what, what, what makes you like that more than the others? Um, there's a lot more strategy involved, uh, a lot of more creeping around, using your teammate. Uh, it's not just uh, waste of balls uh, and spray and pray. Yeah, so, use a lot less paint. Yeah, exactly. Tac so, so tactical appeals to you? Absolutely, 100%. Excellent. And to you? Woods ball as well. And so when you say woods ball, you mean like a rec ball or also military sim or which one? Oh, which oh one? I see. Uh, I like the military sim. Okay, and yeah. you, we, we played together. We and played a together weeks ago. a couple weeks ago. What made that so great? What made it so great was that you, it's so creative. I mean, it really is a military simulation. I, I actually work for the military, and so it was really neat to see military tactics involved in paintball. Mm -hmm. I mean, everything from they had tanks, they have, um, snipers. you know, snipers, medics. Yeah. You can revive people, you know, when they get shot. Yeah, um, you're using CVs and calling back to the general to see where, where more support is needed on the field. How many people really do we cool. have in that? Did you remember? I think it was like 50 to 60 per team. That was not bad. And usually they're much bigger, so the more the merrier. All right, thanks, right. Craig. Thanks, right. PJ. Absolutely. Thank you. And I am with? Matt Negroponte. And Matt, where are you from? I'm from uh, Wilmington, Delaware. Yeah, so, and we're at OXCC today. Uh, tell me, what, what is your preferred format? Uh, I prefer, to, you know, doing the rec ball type, you know, paintball scenarios just because of the fact that, you know, speedball, you kind of lose your, your, your passion for the game. You kind of forget why we started playing. You know, it becomes very competitive and becomes about the win and not about the game anymore. Yeah, it's an intense experience. Almost definitely. Yeah, so he's, he's talking rec ball, he's got the speedball shirt on. <laughs> Some things die hard, right? Yeah, taking a step back and giving yeah. it back to the youngins, you know? Yep. This is what it's about, you know? When we, we get older and from playing for years and we teach it to the young ones. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Ollie Lang, his first game was a, was a, a paintball party. Most definitely, yeah. so most definitely. We all start somewhere. Thanks, man. No problem, thank you. You know the question this week, what do you prefer, Milsim scenario, rec ball or speed ball? And I'm with? Connor. And Connor, where are you from? Uh, Newark. Newark, Delaware? Mm -hmm. All right, so which do you prefer? Um, I prefer speed ball just because it's a little quicker. I feel there's more strategy and more teamwork in it. It's just, and, I like it better. And you're out at rec ball today, so mm -hmm. what, 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 made, what made you change up today? Um, well, my friend hasn't played much, so we're going to play this for a little bit. Okay. And we're see how it goes. Kind of get him used to the game. Mm -hmm. Awesome. And that's how we all start. Danger Man here from Behind the Bunker, and this week's question is, what format of play do you prefer, Milsim, Speedball, or Rec Ball? And I'm with? Uh, I'm Dan. Dan, where are you from? Uh, I am from Delaware, Dover. Okay, so you've driven what, about half an hour, 45 minutes? About 45 minutes to get here. Worth the trip to get to OXCC? Yes. Awesome. So, what do you prefer, Rec Ball, Milsim, or Speedball? I actually prefer a little bit of uh, Woods Ball and then a little bit of Speedball as well. It's, okay. It's a little Why bit. those choices? Uh, I could get to run around. I get a little, you know, free space, and you know, you have more of a uh, way to go. You know, bunker down and have some fun camouflage, a little stealth. And what's the appeal of speedball to you? Speedball is it's fast. You got to be quick on your toes. You got to talk to your teammates uh, to get the job done quick and effective. All right. So, and you left one out. What, why not? Why not the third? What's I've the... never done it to be honest. Okay, there you <laughs> That's go. Why. Fair enough answer. Are you going to try it? One day, yeah. All right. I encourage you. Maybe we'll play on the same team. All right. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Danger Man here. I'm at OXCC on a beautiful Sunday morning, and we're about to get a ton of guys out here. For Behind the Bunker this week, our question is, what format of play do you like to play in? Do you like to play mill sim, speed ball, or just straight up rec ball? Uh, for me, I prefer uh, speed ball or rec ball. And what, what, what pulls you towards speed ball? Uh, I, I just like the competitive nature about it, all the players out there screaming and yelling, just having a good time playing. Now, a lot of people get away. They don't want to play speed ball. What draws you to it as opposed to, you know, so many people saying, yeah, it's just not for me? Uh, for me, I'm a competitive person. I play sports since I was six years old, so the, the competitive nature of it just really draws me to it. And, and what, how, how old are you right now? You're what, 24? I'm 17. So, 
So at 17, you've got the legs for it. Yes, sir. All right, so look me up in about 15 years when your legs give out and you want to just play straight up rec ball. I definitely will. And I'm with, who are you? Are? Brian. And Brian, you're a ref here at OXDC? Yes, I am. And what do you, what do you see week to week in terms of people you know, playing? What, what do you see bigger crowds at? I mean, is it kind of balanced across the board? Um, it depends on the day, really. Like today, when it's really nice out, I'm pretty sure we'll have a bigger crowd of rec ball players and speed ball players. But right now, they're gearing up for a tournament, so I'm pretty sure we'll have a lot of speed ball players here today. All right, thanks for your time, Brian. All right, thank you. It's too much for any man!